Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about a little gadget that I think every single person who owns a smartphone, a tablet, or any kind of USB power device needs to have. And the best part, it's ridiculously cheap. This is a USB power meter. It's a tiny device that plugs in between your charger and your phone. And what it does is it tells you exactly what's happening with the electricity flowing into your device. Think of it as a doctor for your gadgets. It can tell you if your charger is healthy, if your cable is working right, and if your phone is getting the power it needs. I got this one off Amazon, and I'll leave a link in the description in case you want to check it out for yourself. So why do you need one of these? Let me give you a few examples. So you just bought this brand new expensive fast charger. The box says it delivers 20 watts of power, but is it? How do you know for sure? You plug this little meter into your power block and it'll tell you instantly if you're getting the promised 20 watts or if you're only getting five. Or what about your cables? If you've got a drawer full of them and one of them charges your phone fast while the others seem to take forever. Are they all the same? Absolutely not. This power meter can expose a bad cable in just a few seconds. A good cable will show as a high current and a bad one will show just a trickle. And what about your power banks? Does your 10,000 milliamp hour power bank really have that much capacity? The meter can help you estimate the true capacity by showing you how much power is being delivered over time. It's the only way to know if you're getting what you paid for. Using it is super easy. First, you plug the power meter directly into your wall charger. Next, you plug your USB cable into the other side of the power meter. And then finally, you plug the cable into your phone. Now you'll see a few numbers on the screen. The most important ones are voltage, which is like the pressure of the electricity, and then the current in amps, which is the flow. Multiply these two together and you get power. See, this combination is giving me a solid 7.5 volts and two amps of current flow, which is a total of 15 watts. This is definitely fast charging. Now, if I swap this out to a really super cheap cable that I got online somewhere, if we look at the drop in the performance, we're down to just five volts and only 0.6 amps. That's a total of three watts. This is why your phone was charging really slowly in this example. So for just a couple of pounds, a cheap USB power meter gives you the power to troubleshoot your charging issues, vet your gear and make smarter purchasing decisions. It's an essential tool for anyone who really cares about their electronics. So if you've ever wondered why your phone is taking forever to charge, a USB power meter might just be the answer. Thanks for watching, guys. If you found this useful, hit that like button and subscribe for more tech tips. Let me know in the comments below if you own one of these power meters and what you've used it for.